On Friday, December 6, 2019, people of all ages gathered outside the Nebraska Union on the University of Nebraska-Lincoln campus and marched to the Capitol where they rallied against climate change. Organizer groups planned these strikes through the use of formal permits as well as the details of an actual strike. We have to get some permits from the city. We have to get one that says that we can march from the Union to the Capitol, and then we have to get another one to say that we can stand here on the North Steps. We also make some graphics, and one of the biggest things that we do, the most important part, is to get the word out. Outside the North Steps of the Capitol, protesters called on political leaders to make a change and recognize the effects of climate change and what they can do to make a difference. Nebraska elected officials are in the beginning processes of putting new plans into action. Here in the city of Lincoln, we are developing our climate action plan right now and we're putting together plans for stronger um, infrastructure, for better resiliency for our community so we can protect all our residences from the unknown, you know, severe weather impacts that we may face in the future. During the climate strike, an open mic is available for anyone to speak their mind. At this specific rally, a few sixth graders shared their resolution that was introduced to the Senate. These Lincoln students have been participating in protests on the same steps for 10 weeks now, and on this Friday, many were called on to join them. We try to have youth-focused speakers, so we want young people to have their voices heard. So we look for that, and we try to get like two or three, and then we open it up, and the most special part of the strike is the open mic session, where anyone can just share what's on their mind, what they're feeling, and stuff like that. They are sacrificing our planet and my future in the name of a prophet. <laughs> Activists are finding it increasingly important to speak their mind in these crises and plan on continuing similar demonstrations throughout the cold winter months. I think it's just important to know that climate, the climate crisis does affect all of us and even if we can't necessarily see it every day, it is still there and that our voice does matter and we need to be using it for change. As the issue of climate change continues, similar strikes will proceed to bring awareness to this global concern. This has been Logan Bergeron and Olivia Oath for the, the MWHS Wildcat, Wildcat News. News.